Use any search engine and search for ImageJ software. Click on Download ImageJ for your convenience. The link to this web page is provided in the description below. Select the ImageJ version for Windows to download the software. Once download is completed, locate the software which is a compressed file. Use appropriate software to extract the file. Locate the extracted ImageJ file and head to the ImageJ icon. Double click on the icon and the ImageJ software will launch and it is ready to use. The ImageJ icon can be conveniently sent to the desktop as a shortcut for easy access. Locate the ImageJ icon in the desktop and use the software. To update the ImageJ software, click on Help and select Update ImageJ. The ImageJ updater will prompt you to update to the latest version. To install Fizi, head to the website as shown in the screen. The link to this website is also available in the description below. Select either 32 or 64 bit according to the operating system. Save the file to download. Once download is complete, locate the file and extract the compressed Fiji file. Double click on the extracted folder and locate Fiji icon. This software is now ready to use. To download and use ImageJ in Mac operating system, head to the website and select either ImageJ bundled with Java or ImageJ bundled with Zulu. Click to download the file. Copy the compressed file and paste it in a separate drive. ImageJ may or may not function if the location is in the desktop. Using appropriate software, extract the file from the compressed folder. The image J icon displays when the file is successfully extracted. Make a double left click on the icon. A warning message may pop up at this stage regarding the software verification. Click Cancel. Head to the system settings on your computer and Scroll down to Privacy and Security. Under Privacy and Security, locate and find the message that display image J was blocked from use because it is not from an identified developer. Select Open Anyway. Depending on the operating system settings, the next pop-up may ask for your operating system username and password to unlock the privacy and security settings. A final warning message may pop up again. Select Open and the ImageJ software will launch. This software is now ready to use. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe for more such videos.